And so this model itself, when I bought it, it was 337 US dollars. What's happening guys and welcome back to our channel. HHKBs or Happy Hacking Keyboards are not your typical keyboards. So what sets it apart from other keyboards in terms of price? Let's have a look at the world's most expensive keyboard, $4,240. But before we do that, subscribe to our channel and do remember to hit that bell icon so you always stay updated about our channel whenever a new video goes up. Now let's start the video. Number 6. Key Switch The Topper Electrostatic Capacitive Switch is used in the making of HHKB. The Capacitive Switch is an HHKB and Real Force exclusive because Capacitive Switches don't have a contact, resulting in them not clattering or bouncing. As a result, key presses and feedback are incredibly smooth. It's been tested to endure 50 million keystrokes over the course of a lifetime. The capacitive switch has three times the number of parts as a membrane switch, which adds to the price. It's made in Japan using long-lasting materials and components. The topper key switches are certified. They have textured PBT keycaps for robust shine-resistant keys, as well as a dye sublimation technique for fade-resistant keycap legends. You'll enjoy a one-of-a-kind keying experience with the HHKB key switches in terms of both touch and sound. The responsiveness of the keys also reduces the amount of pressure required to trigger the key, which reduces hand and finger strain. Number 5. The Comfort I spend hours and hours and hours on this thing every single day, and so it's really important to me to have a very comfortable keyboard. The HHKB provides optimum comfort over lengthy periods. Each key row is curved slightly differently, producing a curve from the side view, allowing your fingers to reach every row while your hand remains in one position. Because your hand never needs to leave the home row, the small size and layout play an essential role. You have every key you require and none that you don't. All of these factors were carefully considered to decrease strain and increase speed and performance. HHKB is an excellent travel companion with its lightweight, ultra-compact size and extensive compatibility. You can use it with all of your regular devices wherever you go. The design of the HHKB is based on ergonomics. Every superfluous, difficult-to-reach key was removed from the ultra-compact 60-key, 10-keyless format. The near-symmetrical arrangement, cylindrical step design, and relocation of the control key make your fingertips feel at home on the home row, decreasing travel length for your fingers and hands, and lowering finger and wrist tiredness or stress-related ailments. Number 4. Materials The keyboard frame and keys are composed of PBT, which is a high-quality and long-lasting material. The PBT structure will not creak or flex, and also contributes to the keyboard's low weight. The keycaps have a thickness of 1.3 to 1.4 millimeters and will not fade or even shine. The keycap symbols are produced using a sublimation dyeing technique, which ensures that the symbols remain permanent since the ink penetrates the keycap. Number 3. Customization Oh, on the note of customization, in addition to being able to change the key maps for all these keys, there's also a dip switch in the back right here. The HHKB offers several configurable features that make it ideal for users in a range of environments. To enhance your unique user experience, utilize the key map customization feature to change each key using a Windows program. These changes are kept on the keyboard, allowing you to utilize the same key map on several devices. For connectivity, some individuals prefer a cable connection for its reliability and speed, while others desire to be mobile and untethered from their device. Both are available at HHKB, Bluetooth Type S and Hybrid, as well as a USB-C cord. You may use Bluetooth to connect up to four devices and switch between them quickly. It includes three variable height settings for wrist comfort, as well as DIP switches for customizing the operation mode. Number 2. Manufacturing Wait, just... The HHKB is made in Japan with careful quality control, 
testing, and quality assurance. The HHKB's major authorized distributor is Fujitsu Computer Products of America, or FCPA. All FCPA-approved keyboards come with a two-year manufacturer's warranty, U.S. certifications, and U.S.-based customer service. Number one, why is it so expensive? And so this model itself, when I bought it, it was 337 U.S. dollars. Professor I.T. Wada, a well-known Japanese developer, designed the HHKB for intensive use and endurance in a Unix or Linux environment. Many other sorts of programmers and developers, on the other hand, have embraced the HHKB as their preferred keyboard. So what differentiates it from other keyboards in terms of cost? The cost of the HHKB is determined by many factors. The high quality of the HHKB is due to the design of the key switch, the materials used, and the thorough manufacturing process. Although the keyboards are pricey, they have a high resale value, making it simpler to check them out and sell them in the aftermarket. There are many various types of keyboards available, each with a distinct price tag. Professionals and keyboard aficionados who use their keyboards all day and night need a tool that can provide them with the precision, speed, and responsiveness that they require. Their keyboard, in the end, becomes an extension of themselves. It's an excellent work of modern technology. This is why we believe an HHKB is worthwhile to purchase since it provides an unparalleled typing experience while also enhancing your daily life. HHKB was initially designed for developers and is ideal for authors, journalists, and touch typing professionals who require maximum comfort and tactile feedback to eliminate errors. So do let us know whether you guys are interested in purchasing an HHKB keyboard for yourself in the comments down below, and I'll see you guys later in another interesting video. Take care now!